What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're eating ice cream babies. You guys know I'm already excited. I got some good news and bad news about this video review though. The good news is I got five of the new Halo Top flavors that you guys have been commenting below asking me to review. So we're gonna do just that. But the bad news is I think I'm still missing like three of the flavors. It was not for a lack of trying, I promise guys. I visited five stores in total, journeyed far and wide to find these things. Had to pick up a couple at one store, one at another store, a couple at this store, and two stores were complete duds. Didn't even carry Halo Tops. I tried guys, I tried. We have five of the flavors. Look for the following three to be reviewed, probably in a vlog coming up, or maybe I'll do another face-off ice cream video, but regardless of all that, guys, we're still gonna have a good time. We're still gonna have some fun. Don't get your underwear in a bundle, guys. This is gonna be a great video. I promise you guys that. So if you're ready to review these flavors, then as always, I'm here to do it for you. Let's do it! We are going to jump right into this. First flavor we are going to do is the new candy bar flavor, another 360 calorie pint. What I've noticed about the new flavors of Halo Top is they go a little higher in calories than the regular ones, but hey, gotta do what you gotta do for that flavor. Am I right, boys? Go ahead, open this bad boy up. Golden Pop Top, boop. Ooh, smell test already doing good. Look, I can see chunks of something down in there. Looks like some nuts. Hold on, I'll give you guys a closer look. You see that? You see that? Got some nut action going on in there? Perfect. Can't go wrong with a little nut action. At least I think that's what those are. Guess we'll find out. Doesn't really tell me what's in here. So I guess we're just gonna wing it. So let's go ahead, get a nice big old spoon here. Ooh, a little bit of everything on here. Let's do it. Three, two, one. Definitely nailed the candy bar flavor on its head. It's kind of like a Heath bar with a hint of Morgan Freeman. You know what I mean? Wise bond its years. This is definitely really good. I don't know what the rating system's gonna be. How about no seals of approval? We got one seal of approval, double seal of approval if I think it's pretty good, and then triple seal of approval if it's out of this world incredible, right? So I'm gonna go ahead and give this one candy bar. Ah, I gotta say, let me do one more bite just to make sure. Can't be giving you guys any bad info, you know what I mean? Mmm. Oh. All right. So this gets the double seal of approval. This is great. Tastes just like a candy bar. Mmm. Can't go wrong, baby. Mmm. <laughs> On to the next one. The next flavor we are reviewing is Moki Green Tea. I have no idea what this is supposed to taste like, so my hopes aren't very high. Green Tea, I'm not really a big fan of. Moki, don't even know what that is. Sounds like a Pokemon. Maybe that's a Digimon. Or a Monster Rancher. Anybody remember that? Comment below if you remember that. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and pop the top. Ooh, not really much to this one. Let me give you guys a peek. Looks like some standard vanilla, if you ask me. Not really sure what, uh, we're, what, what we're gonna get into here. Without further ado, let's get this taste test under roux. Under roux? What? All right, let's get down in here. Nice little bite. This tastes like shampoo or conditioner or one of those weird things where you're trying to be cheap so you buy the combo of the two, shampoo, conditioner, combo, does about half of what each do, ruins your hair, damages it. Probably the reason why I'm bald. Ugh. All right, we're gonna do one more just to see if it, I don't know, gets better. I'm not even kidding. This tastes like pine salt. Ugh. No seals of approval. Moki green tea, <laughs> no go. <laughs> no go. Don't do it! Don't do it! <laughs> now this next flavor I'm pretty excited about. The one after it, not so much. But this one, excited. Caramel macchiato. I'm not sure what a macchiato is. Sounds like an exotic car. I think it's like a coffee or something. Could be completely wrong. Who knows? But I'm going in with the best of intentions and the highest of hopes. Really, that's what life boils down to, right? You gotta go into any situation like that. Pop the top. Boop! All right, smells like coffee, so I think I was right on that part. Did I even say that? I don't know. Give you guys a closer look here. Nothing special. Looks like another basic ice cream, no chunks, kind of like the last one, and it's a 280 calorie pint, so I was kind of wrong. This one doesn't have as high a calories. Let's go in and get this taste test underway. Take a bite. No, eh, you know? Hey, the United Postal Service guy's outside delivering a package. What's up, bud? How you doing? Don't you steal my chairs. Okay, he didn't steal any chairs. Got, you, you gotta watch those guys. You gotta, you gotta watch those guys. All right, we're gonna do one more bite. Mm. Okay, I get the gist. I get the gist, Deborah. So, caramel macchiato. Tastes kind of like a coffee with a hint of caramel flavor. So, all in all, it's not bad. I'm not a big coffee fan. I'm gonna give that one the single seal of approval. Definitely better than the last one. Definitely passable. I'd buy this, but I don't think it'd be my first choice, so. Hey, if you like coffee, though, could be the ice cream for you. Now, this is the flavor that I was least excited about. Chocolate covered banana. If you've been following me long enough, you realize that I'm not a big banana fan. I'm not really a banana man, fam. You get what I'm saying? A banana fan, a fan of banana men. No, that came out wrong. I'm not a banana guy. I don't like bananas. There we go. We're just gonna leave that there. So go ahead and pop the top. Not really excited about this. Ugh, and it smells just like bananas. We're gonna give it a shot though. Woo. Okay, let me give you guys a look at this. This one you can see has something in it, right? You got the white, then you got the brown. So I imagine that's the chocolate, and I imagine the white's the banana. If I was a betting man. So let's go ahead and do this. I am not pumped. We're gonna get right in the middle, right? With the little with the little chocolate swirl. Get down in there. Are right, you guys ready? 
three, two, one. Don't need any more of that. Ooh. If you like bananas, I imagine you'd like this. Not a fan. Not a fan. For my own personal preference, if you like bananas, you might love this because the banana flavor is strong with this one. <laughs> strong with this one. Not a, not a fan. So I, this gets no seals of approval. So, so far we've had one double seal, we've had one single seal, and we've had two zero seals. So let's hope the final flavor that we try up next, which is going to be good, is better than this. <laughs> now before we even get into this final flavor, do you guys notice how I keep switching the camera angles around on you? That's what you call immersion, ladies and gentlemen. You didn't even notice, but I do. Now you do. Now it's awkward. Okay, let's get to the final flavor cinnamon roll baby this was the one i was most excited about so definitely pumped for this one let's see if it can beat out candy bar and see if it can maybe take my new top spot because i don't think candy bar beats red velvet for me personally or chocolate chip cookie dough so let's see if this one takes the cake ah! All right, can't really see a whole lot going on here. Once again, I'm gonna give you guys the bird's eye view. As you can see, not a whole lot of uh, really much going on there. But hey, looks can be deceiving. Let's get down to business. You guys ready? All right, is anything down in there? Nope, a little hint of some swirl, but nothing, nothing sticking out to me. Smells good. All right, three, two, one. I think we found the winner. Just to make sure it's not a fluke, you know what I mean? This kind of tastes like Alien vs Predator, except we're the winners, right? And we weren't even included in the verses. We weren't even on the card. Get down here and get another one. This tastes like if you dropped Tom Cruise into the Game of Thrones world as modern day Tom Cruise, you know what I mean? He wasn't even in that time frame, but now he's there. It's wacky, he's got a cell phone, no one knows what to think. And there's dragons. <laughs> All right, we'll do one more just because this is so delicious. Mm, okay, definitely, definitely, definitely amazing, for sure. Now, it definitely gets the double seal of approval, but it doesn't get the triple seal. The triple seal is coveted worldwide across the world as a badge of honor and this just doesn't quite have that but it's definitely good enough for the double seal of approval really good so awesome now let's rank all these flavors in order and i'll tell you guys from my favorite to my least favorite which ones you should buy which ones you should try and ultimately what my recommendations are so let's go my favorite flavor by far was the cinnamon roll well i don't want to say by far the candy bar was actually pretty close so that one comes in second but i will say the cinnamon roll edged it out a little bit if you're gonna try any of these two cinnamon roll and candy bar are amazing i'm kind of upset i didn't get to get the pancakes and syrup flavor because i feel like that would have been my favorite but oh well guys another time right another video and then third place was the caramel macchiato which wasn't bad i would definitely eat it but it wouldn't be my go-to choice right single seal of approval as you guys seen my fourth flavor is going to be the mochi green tea because i would still rather drink shampoo than eat a banana but hey everybody's got their opinion so if you like banana hey that could propel that to the front for you but i'm just not a banana man a fan banana man a fan of banana men no not that again and then fifth obviously the banana chocolate covered banana flavored halo top was fifth so all in all the new flavors, um, like I said, two I was pretty pleased with. The other three were kind of, well, two of, the, two of them were terrible, but the one was kind of in the middle. So I won't say that there's any new reigning favorites here. I might have to eat an entire pint of candy bar, an entire bite of cinnamon roll to see if they actually take the place of some of my longstanding favorites. But for now, they're not bad, you know? So I'll finish those off once I can fit them into my macros and maybe I'll give you guys an updated opinion for too much longer. But hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. I try to bring a diverse selection of content to my channel. So we do vlogs, we try to do training videos, we do cooking, meal prep. I try to bring a lot of different things and ultimately what I make is comes down to you guys So if you guys want to see more videos like this or if you like the style of this or you think my humor is not too stupid And you get a few laughs out of it Which is ultimately all I'm trying to do if you're hating on my humor You can just leave because I don't do this for you. I do this for the people that laugh <laughs> Yeah, you guys know so just comment below Let me know if you enjoyed this and let me know down in the comment section because I do read it and I do take your feedback I promise you guys that so thank you so very much If you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit that like button it helps me out more than you even know I'm telling you guys you don't even understand how much that helps so if you're able to hit that thumbs up button and I'd be forever grateful, I promise. And they have a new thing on here now. If you go up to the subscribe box, right, there's a little bell next to it. You can be notified of when I post videos, which not only helps you guys, kinda, because it lets you know when I post a video, but it helps me out because you guys know when I post a video. See, it's a win-win, guys. It's a give and a take, you know what I mean? We're in this together. So, as always, guys, hopefully, like I said, you enjoyed this video. And, 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 don't forget to smile, remain positive, and pay someone a compliment because you never know whose day you could be making better. With that, I am out of here. This has been a Remington James production and I will see you fine ladies and gentlemen at the next video. See you guys.